nominee for Best Actress. I will go to church every Sunday. Alex Young for September Song. I will stop acting as if I am above the law. And the Best Actress Oscar goes to... I will end the names of all those people who work in my house. Alex Young. Huh? Honey, you can't go up there. Why not? You're naked. Uh, okay. Which one was it? Naked, forgot speech, or the Oscar goes to Madonna? Naked. Oh. <laughs> it's the fourth time tonight. I know. You do realize you're starting to go a little crazy here. Oh, Patrick, I am two exits past crazy and one stop from... <laughs> okay, but after tonight, no more nightmares. Oh, okay. Tomorrow is Oscar day. <laughs> and it's going to be the best day of your life. Yeah, you know what? You're right. Whew. Yeah, what would I do without you? Okay. You come here. Ah! Oh, it's going to be a long night. at all? 23 minutes. Well, I know something that always puts you to sleep. <laughs> no! Woo! Okay, that's new. Why is your agent ah! watching us? Oh my god. No, 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 no. Don't let me interrupt. Finish up, I can wait. Okay, Elliot, Elliot, honey, what are you doing here? It's Oscar morning! <laughs> I'm not gonna wish my favorite client luck. I was gonna suggest you do some exercises, get the jitters out that way, but this is better. Okay. Elliot, why don't I meet you downstairs, okay? Thanks. You still got that slutty housekeeper? Wait. Let it be a surprise. Right, come on, clear your head. I am not going to let anything ruin this day. <laughs> Come here. <laughs> oh, what are you doing? What? I thought you liked it when I touched you there. Not you, Sherry. If you think you're not glad to see me, where do you see what's coming down the hall? What? Mom. Mom? What, what Mom? Uh, scotch and cigarettes, Mom. I heard that! <laughs> and you're out of scotch. <laughs> What are you doing here? I wanted to surprise you for the Oscars. I would miss our special day for anything. Oh, ah! <laughs> oh, I'm Suzanne. Alex is mom. Uh, yeah, yeah, yeah. I'm Patrick. Where I come from, handshakes are for bankers. <gasps> <clears throat> something tells me you greet bankers that way, too. Mom, listen, we're kind of in the middle of something here, so... Oh, my sweet baby. Making love on Oscar morning. Oh, my God. I'm just happy it's not low self-esteem sex. I'm right here, Mom. <laughs> yep, just hanging out in bed with my girlfriend and her mom. <laughs> he's funny. <laughs> and he's hairy. <laughs> I like him. Good. I'm just happy you finally got a good one. <laughs> A very good one. Okay, Alex's hair team upstairs. Makeup people in the master bath. Wardrobe in the living room. Any queens not accounted for? <laughs> On, people, it's all in the pamphlet. Now man your stations. Move, move, move! Where am I supposed to be? Living in St. Louis with your dental hygienist wife and your two ugly kids. <laughs> but God hates me, so here you are. <laughs> Excuse me, Sherry, ugly kids. 
I don't think so. <laughs> okay, Alex, uh, you have like 3,000 emails and you're... It's Oscar day. Not now! <laughs> the car is picking you up at five and here is your itinerary. Okay, anything in this itinerary about how to deal with our insane mother? Please, do not even get me started. There are like a thousand bedrooms in this place. Why does she always have to take mine? Please, why did she live in a tree for three years? Why did she cook every meal in pickle juice? Hey, why did she paint the dog? Why did she shoot the mailman? Why did she do anything she does? Your mom shot a mailman? <laughs> to be fair, he wasn't a very good mailman. So you had no idea she was coming? No, I talked to her like two days ago and she never mentioned it, but that's mom, you know? My big day and she has to sweep in at the last minute and be the center of attention. Remember my high school graduation? Her blouse just happened to pop open. My first movie premiere? Her blouse just happened to pop open. This place is getting weird, man. I just went to use the bathroom and some delicately framed man just grabbed me and plucked an eyebrow. <laughs> Those are Alex's people getting her all pretty up for the Oscars. Oh, right. Is that tonight? You guys are all going together, right? Kind of slipped my mind. You sure you're okay about not going? Hey, it's cool. It's a big night for big, important people. I'm just one of the little people the winners should thank. No pressure. <laughs> oh, here y'all are. I ask you, who's not going to want to chew this off me tonight? <laughs> Mom, what's with the dress? I had it made for the Academy Awards. Isn't it beautiful? Yeah, it's, it's more beautiful than my dress. Was yours designed by an Appalachian witch? No. I didn't think so. So what time's the car picking us up? Mom, you just showed up on my doorstep like an hour ago. You're really not expecting to go to the awards with us, are you? No, dear. I flew across the country during the middle of NASCAR season to watch it on TV. <laughs> My little C-section's nominated. Uh, Mom, it's like impossible to get tickets. I only have three. Patrick, me, and Sherry. I wish you'd called or something. Well, I was just so excited and I wanted to surprise you. And in a way, I kind of felt like this was my nomination too. Well, here we go. I mean, I had to give up my acting career when I got pregnant with you. And then when Sherry came along, I had to give up on everything else. That girl came into the world like a rabid wolverine. <laughs> I'm sure you're drinking and smoking your way through pregnancy had nothing to do with it. I am okay. I was a great actress. I mean, I didn't go in for this film nonsense. I was a mistress of the theater. More like you were the mistress of the owner of the theater. I mean, I don't see what the big deal is. I'll just take Sherry's ticket. You don't mind, do you, dear? Yeah, I do mind, dear. <laughs> Please don't let mom take my ticket. It's bad enough she took my prom date. Honey, I know I should bow out, but I really want to be there with you. Okay, and I want you to be there with me. And I want you to be there with me. And you traveled 3,000 miles. <laughs> During NASCAR season. Who do you love? Who do you love? Okay, did you have any luck? You've got three tickets. Yes, Elliot, I already have three tickets. I needed you to get me a fourth. Oh, then you're screwed. Oh, but, 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 oh, okay. I can't believe this. This is too difficult. The fact is, we, we, we can't all go, and I should pretty much be there. Well, isn't that typical? So this leaves me with two tickets to split between three people that I love. I feel like Meryl Streep and Sophie's Choice. <laughs> she won, didn't she? <laughs> Who's getting the tickets? Okay, I have decided. I can't decide. <laughs> I will see two of you in the limo. The other one I will either sleep with, go shopping with, or refill their flask. <laughs> okay, there are two tickets between the three of us. Now, the way I see it... <laughs> okay! One ticket for the two of us. And the way I see it, no, you I will take down. Now, just to be clear, the first contestant to get to 10 in Who Knows Alex Better gets a third ticket. The loser stays home with the predominantly Hispanic staff. <laughs> Let's bring out our host, Stevie Hansen! Thank you, thank you. Okay, let's get this party started, shall we? Question number one, are we ready? 
Who was the first boy to kiss Alex? Ricky. Bingo! One for Sherry. My lord, you made out with your cousin Ricky? No! It was the boy at the bakery. That's your cousin. What? <laughs> Okay, question number two, right here. Who is the first boy to get to second base with Alex? Me? <laughs> <laughs> Trick question. Alex skipped second base. Okay, let's just stop with the questions about my sexual history with boys, okay? Okay. <laughs> what is Alex's favorite flower? Calypso Orchids. Favorite teeny bopper crush? Duran Duran. Favorite book? Ice Magazine. Thank God I already got a ticket. I don't know any of this crap. That's sweet, Mom. Oh, right. I'm a bad mother. No one said that, Mom. So I'm a good mother? No one said that, Mom. <laughs> okay, we are all tied up here at 9-9. Next question is for all the chatter. Are we ready? Okay. Wait, can I ask the last question? How is that fair? You get it right, you go. You get it wrong, I go. What do you think? Anything to end this game. Chips is on. <laughs> this thing with you and my sister, are you just having fun for a while dating a movie star or are you in it for the long haul? It's the real deal. <laughs> what? Just answer it truthfully. It's the real deal. I hope it's forever. Patrick wins. <laughs> Congratulations. Sherry, th thank you. That yeah, is the... uh, let's not make it a thing. Wow. It's like when the Grinch's heart grew three times its size. <laughs> Sherry, hey, uh, I just want to thank you again for giving me your ticket. It was really selfless, and I'd give you a hug right now, but I'm afraid you'd need me in the jimmies. Please, Patrick, I could care less about going to the Academy Awards. Hey, Sherry, where are you? Oh, Sherry, listen, I have great news. You got me a ticket? You got me a ticket? <laughs> hey, do I have to do? Oh, I don't even care. I'll just find out when I get there. I'm going to the Academy Awards. Sherry, slow down. It's not a ticket. It's a job as a seat filler. A seat filler? That is for losers. What's a seat filler? When someone important has to go backstage or to the bathroom or something, they have a regular person fill in the seat, so it looks good on TV still. Wow, that is for losers. I'll do it. I don't even know who she was going to do. No way! My sister, I'm filling seats. I gotta go shake my pits. I'm going to the Academy Awards! Oh, <laughs> geez, imagine me. Attention, makeup. We have a situation. Meet me in the master bath. Stacked. Uh. Hey, what's up? When I want to go to the Oscars, Alex didn't try to get me a job as a seat filler. Oh, Steve, you don't want that job. All I'm saying is that she wanted to make sure that you were there and Sherry was there. What about me? What about the Fantastic Four? <laughs> the who? Sometimes I call us that. The point is, God, well, I thought Alex and I were kind of friends. I see we are kind of friends. No, we're not. We're friends through you. I'm not even a blip on her radar. I can't blame her, man. I mean, look at me. I'm a substitute teacher. The beautiful, flaxen haired substitute teacher. I've never done anything to deserve her attention. I've never done anything great. I gotta go. Stevie, you're not gonna do something stupid, are you? Not stupid. Great. <laughs> oh, it's gonna be so stupid. <laughs> no. No. Everyone hurry up! The limo's here! I don't wanna be late! It's my big night! <gasps> oh my god, you scared me. I thought you were an end table. <laughs> And I thought you were a woman of class and dignity. Looks like we're both wrong. Are you married? Maybe. Maybe not. Are you being coy? No, I, I really don't know. Come on! Let's get there!
there. Diane Keaton might have to pee, and I'll have to fill her seat. That's what I do. Take up space. Ladies and gentlemen, may I have your attention, please? For years, she has dazzled us with her beauty and elegance. Oh, crap! I'm sweating like a fat guy eating soup. Dame Alex Young. Oh, my baby! Is that what you're wearing? Why would you say that to me? I'm nervous enough as it is. What are you nervous about? If you win, just don't start climbing over the seats like that Roberta Banana guy. No one likes to show off. Alex, you look great, and I wish you the best of luck. Now, what are we all standing around here for? There's free booze in the limo. Hell, there's free booze in my purse. Ooh, after you, Suzanne. <laughs> oh, look at that! My gown popped open. <laughs> Please, hurry up. We really don't need another daddy. Hey. Hey. Uh, look, if, if you win tonight, I know you're not gonna have any time, so I, I thought we could just take this time now. Uh, one question, though. Who is that? Oh, he's the security that comes with my Van Cleef and Arpels jewels. <laughs> okay. <laughs> I got you a little something. What's this? You remember uh, a couple of months ago? Oh my God, the necklace I saw in the window, you remembered. Yeah, it's what I do. <laughs> but I didn't realize you were gonna be wearing a South African diamond mine on your neck, so, uh, I don't know, maybe you can put this in your purse or... I love you. Van Cleef and Arpels is not gonna like this. It's Oscar that again, ladies and gentlemen. Always exciting, and this year, of course, is doubly exciting because I have finally learned to spell E. <laughs> Anyhow, over there, I see the best actress nominee, Alex Young, with her boyfriend, school teacher, Patrick Owen. Very cute. You can keep Melissa after school anytime. Hi, thank you. Oh, thank you so much. An Appalachian witch. Mom, they're asking about my dress. <laughs> Boy, it's all gonna be about you tonight, isn't it? Ladies and gentlemen, welcome to the 76th Annual Academy Awards. When we return, the award for Best Actress. And we're in commercial. Oh my God, this show is long. I'm on my second hangover. Undo my bra. Guess who? Ew! Sherry, honey, what are you doing? That's Marley Matlin's seat. Yeah, and I'm filling it. Apparently, someone tipped off security that she's carrying a suspicious package. Rock and roll! Hey, what are you doing? Streaking, what are you doing? No way! Put your clothes back on and go home. I'm the only one who's streaking tonight. What's your cause? I'm proving to a friend that I can do something great. All my life, I've been a nobody. So tonight, I'm proving to Alex Young I can be a somebody. Why, what's your cause? I'm protesting oil drilling in our national forests and parks. My nakedness symbolizes the stripping of our nation's beauty. My cause trumps yours, so take that. Hey, there's nothing more noble than wanting to do something great. Less drilling. Something great. Less drilling. Something great. Less drilling. Oh. Is that Stevie wrestling another naked man? I knew it was gonna be stupid. <laughs> Thank you. I'll take my seat now. Nice try, Matlin. Beat it. Huh? You heard me. No, I did not. <laughs> I'm sitting here now. Go find another seat. Oh, you idiot. <laughs> and we're back from commercial in five, four, three, two. The award for Best Actress. 
Thank you. Oh my god, is there a the camera on me or can I throw up now? T-shirt Castle Hughes for Whale Rider. But I want an Oscar. I don't care if you want an Oscar, you're about to win a kick in the face. <laughs> Charlie's Theron for Monster. Naomi Watts for 21 grams. And Alex Young for September Song. And the Academy Award for Best Actress goes to... I was a great actress. I didn't go in for the, any of the... For, for the... What's the line? I wonder that's still not a thing up here. Thank you very much, Ruth. Come here. Oh, is this another dream? Yep. It's gonna be a long night. 